This is a question some of you have asked or wondered. Is it allergies or coronavirus? A lot of you are wondering, especially if you find yourself for those around you sneezing a little bit more than usual. Our Shira Matsuzawa spoke with an expert this afternoon about how you can tell the difference. Shira, you've heard me in the newsroom when I sneeze. I always follow that with allergies not the coronavirus. That's right, Mark. And you know, feeling sick in any sort of way right now can be scary, but with allergy season here and in full bloom, as you know, Mark, it can be confusing. So here's what we found out. Spring is in the air, and that means flowers are blooming and pollen is flying through the air. <coughs> And while the Asthma and Allergy Foundation of America says more than 50 million Americans are used to waking up with sore throats and stuffy noses because of allergies, this year it has a lot of people asking this. In every patient that I talk to, the first or the last question is always, do you think it's COVID? Dr. Neetu Talreja is a board-certified allergist. She says right now she's seeing an influx of people mistaking allergy symptoms for COVID-19 symptoms. Can I tell you 90% of the times now, or 95? Most of the time, it's probably common flu and spring allergy season, pollen, allergies. Um, but yeah, the worry is out there. So how can you tell the difference? Dr. Talrija says spring allergy symptoms include things like itchy eyes and nose and sneezing, while the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention says coronavirus symptoms include fever, cough, and shortness of breath. But while there are some allergy symptoms that can mimic those of COVID-19, such as sore throat and runny nose, Dr. Talrija says, If you don't have fever, then it's probably not COVID. As we work to move past the COVID-19 crisis, it appears allergies will be sticking around. 80 to 90 percent of the uh, people have some kind of sensitivity to either the spring allergens or fall allergens or grass pollen, which blooms in summer, or to their animal, to animal dander during, or dust mites. So, you know, you, you are talking uh, about people where allergies are much, way more common to, to you know, uh, than COVID. As I mentioned, spring allergies are in full bloom, but in case you didn't know, there are actually different allergies for different seasons, so we could see allergy season as a whole lasting from now until November. Meantime, the doctor I spoke with says, when in doubt, reach out and ask a professional. Mark? It really is about the fever, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, all right, Shira, yeah. thanks.